Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum, my dear student. Uh, today, a uh, topic is a linkage of biology with other field of study. This is lecture number two of unit number one. So let's start. Uh, Sometimes one science field use the application of another science to explain a phenomenon. Such, such a linkage between two sciences is called linkage. So here we will discuss the linkage of biology with other sciences. Sometimes it is also called interdisciplinary science. Interdisciplinary science study the involvement uh, that involve the combining of two or more sciences discipline into one activity. It draw knowledge from several other fields like physics, chemistry, geography, ec uh, economics, statistics, etc. So uh, now uh, let's discuss some of the linkage of biology with other fields. The first one that is biophysics. In biophysics, we uh, use uh, the application and the principle of physics to explain a biological activity or phenomenon. Uh, so biophysics usually use uh, in physiology, bioenergetic, neurosciences, and pharmacology. Actually, these are the sub branches of biology. Uh, to explain the biophysics linkage, uh, an example, the first example. That is a uh, liver principle. Liver, you will study uh, that what is liver in physics and what are the principles of that liver. So you, we use that principle to explain the movements of limbs in the animals. Uh, what are limbs, uh, limbs, these four limbs, these hands, hind limbs. So the bending and the movement of these limbs they work on the principle of liver and that is physics. Uh, another example is photosynthesis. Photosynthesis is a phenomena in which green plant prepare its own food from carbon dioxide, water and the presence of light and chlorophyll etc. But uh, you will uh, study this photosynthesis in uh, some of the chapter in very detail. This biological uh, process in uh, photosynthesis a light is absorbed. This absorption of light is on the basis of principle. So once again, the biology use the principle of physics and such a linkage, such a knowledge, uh, such a field is called biophysics. Uh, now, uh, the second date is biochemistry. As you know, that uh, chemistry is, it is one of the branch of the science in which we study about the chemical structure, composition of uh, matter, molecules, compound, different kinds of chemical reaction. So if such kind of process, uh, chemical reaction, they take place in a living organism, so that uh, study will be called biochemistry. Uh, for example, uh, metabolism of photosynthesis. So there is a reaction, so they enrich carbon dioxide plus water, uh, they change into glucose, and oxygen in the presence of light. So that chemical reaction. So that is the chemistry. But this is a biological phenomena. So that is biochemistry. Same is the respiration. Respiration is also uh, a biochemistry uh, study in which uh, uh, from food energy uh, is evolved and carbon dioxide is also evolved. So that is also a metabolic reaction. So these are two are the example of the biochemistry. The next uh, linkage uh, is uh, biogeography. Biogeography actually it uh, deal uh, with the study of occurrence and distribution of different species of living organism into different geological uh, region. The different geological region have different environment. So uh, this, the animals or the plants that are living in different geological region, they have different characteristics. So by, ge by geography, study the characteristic of living organism according to their environment, according to their geography. Like, uh, uh, for example, 
polar bear that is found in uh, certain parts of the Arctic region. So why it is found? Because it have while you have some characteristics, they are adopted to date. Like other uh, example is malaria. Uh, they uh, cause uh, malaria causing mosquito. That is called anopheles. So they are uh, found near the damp and warm areas. So so it means that this mosquito have some of the characteristics they can uh, adopt it to that kind of environment. So such kind of study or uh, uh, linkage of biology uh, is called uh, biogeography. The next uh, inter uh, uh, linkage uh, of biology with uh, that is mathematics. So that is biomathematics, it is also called biometry. It deals with the study of uh, using mathematical and statistical formula, technique and tools and biological work usually it is used in the research data the data that is collected that how it will be designed so how it will be analyzed uh, so all these based on uh, statistic and mathematics and uh, you will ex uh, we will explain inshallah in the next chapter at the end that uh, uh, how uh, biology use uh, statistic and uh, formula knowledge uh, in uh, field of research etc uh, the next one uh, that uh, linkage is uh, bioeconomics uh, bioeconomics it deal with the study of organism from economic point of view for example the cost and profit value of wheat if we sow a seed so what will be the cost of the seed what will be the cost of pesticide what will be the cost of uh, labor etc and if the production from production how much uh, profit we will get so all these things the profit uh, uh, and loss uh, with regarding to uh, a living organism uh, maybe animal maybe plant like in this case wheat so there is bioeconomics so this was the lecture number two of unit number one thank you